All right, we are at an undisclosed location. We have some Kone machines on a Polaris system. Now these were originally Westinghouse, then got a TKE mod in the 2000s, and got modded yet again within the last couple years. Pretty cool stuff. Stalled in the 70s. These are Ecodisc MX-18 machines, and I believe they go 800 feet per minute. This machine's for a pretty interesting car. This car's actually completely external. Very noisy machines. Just little brakes up there. can hardly hear um, the machines over all the brakes. These things are insanely busy right now. Every car is running non-stop. So, yeah. Brakes released and should start moving. These governors are made by Hollister Whitney. Machines, Kone MX-18. What speed these could actually go? Three point eighteen milli um three point eighteen millimeters a second. So these might actually um these might only go five hundred no seven hundred, I'm I'm sorry. They'd likely not use MX-18 for an install that fast. We'll talk about loud brakes. I don't know what's going on with these filters, but I feel some sort of airflow being pulled into them. Not much, but a little. That's kind of interesting. Our HVAC is right here. We see there's some vents going directly at the machines. Which is good. These used to be on the Westinghouse Selectomatic system when they were installed. So obviously those use a lot of power and generate a ton of heat. Turning it vertical to get some control of pictures. There's your VF drive down there. Here's your Polaris management right here. See? They are hoarding keys. A lot of them. I have all these already, but like, wow, it's a lot of keys. It looks like it's a big blower in there, some sort of pressurization. These brakes are really loud and probably need to be adjusted. I was actually in here when the old Westinghouse machines and TAC-50 controllers were in here. Which they were such early TAC-50 controllers, they were actually just rebranded Traplomatic 4. <laughs> yeah, that's great. That one has a bad contactor. Not supposed to make that noise. Here's some 
little auto transformers, 35 kBA, according to the label on it. The big boy capacitors down there. Kinda odd, wonder if they repaired the VFDs themselves to a certain extent. So you see it has some screw holes, which most don't because they don't want you repairing stuff. Alright. I think that will about conclude our video. Pretty awesome equipment. Let's get into the final pictures. Alright, that will be it.